I'm Tony Sklar with Bnet TV. We are here at the Parallels booth in IFA in Berlin 2012, and I'm speaking with Mr. Kirk Schumacher. How are you today, sir? Doing very well. Show's been great for us. Fantastic show. It's so huge. It's absolutely massive, uh, but it's such a great show, and uh, this year it's proven so far to be bigger than last year. I think you're right. I've read about lots of great announcements. We had one also. We announced a new version of our flagship product, Parallels Desktop for Mac, version 8 just came out. So what are some of the new features that, uh, that you're showing off? In Parallels Desktop 8, one of the biggest new features is even better integration with the Mac OS in Mountain Lion, for example. You may know that Mountain Lion has a dictation feature. We've made it possible for any Windows app that accepts text to also use dictation. So if you've used dictation in Mountain Lion, now you can use it in all your Windows apps also. Is there some sort of crossover when you're running uh, a Windows environment on Mac where you're still able to utilize a lot of the um, Mac-generated uh, OS functionality? I think that's one of the big features of Parallels Desktop is it does integrate the features of Mac OS very well into Windows apps. For example, Lion and Mountain Lion all have really nice gestures. You can use those in Windows apps also because of Parallels. We've tried to make the integration so that it just feels like Windows apps just run on your Mac. You don't even have to worry about it. You can dial as much seeing of Windows as you want, or you can have it be where Windows just completely takes over your screen, if you, if you desire. Let's talk a little bit about security. What are some of the security risks for a corporation that's generally used to running a strictly Windows environment? In Parallels, when you run a Windows, run a Windows OS, it has all the same security features that Windows has. When you put it in one of our two networking modes called bridge networking, it's a first class citizen on the network and can be administered by the IT professionals inside a company just as if it were a Windows machine. I think that's one of the biggest um, fears of a networking um, a person inside a corporation is when they're used to rolling out uh, massive desktop features throughout the network and then they come across into the Mac and OS environment and then they kind of get a little, uh oh, you know, what do we do now? It's been a bit of a challenge for IT people as the number of Macs in enterprises has grown a lot. Because of this, we specifically introduced an, a new edition of Parallels Desktop, Enterprise Edition, to address exactly those concerns that IT managers have with deployment and management of Macs and Parallels Desktop in an enterprise. Let's uh, also briefly touch on the idea of the iPad. So the iPad is also extremely popular in business. And so we introduced last year an application called Parallels Mobile which allows you to connect to both your virtual machines running on your Mac as well as your Mac itself. I went on a world press tour last year and from Singapore I could connect to my Mac at home and my Mac in the office back in Renton, Washington as if I was right there nearby. Those are absolutely fantastic features. Um, finally, Kirk, what are we going to see some from parallels here within the next 12 months? Well, I'm not going to talk about future features, unfortunately. Nothing to share there today. But we are really excited about the launch of Parallels Desktop 8 and getting that out to as many of our existing customers as possible, as well as new customers who are moving to the Mac. Um, is it available today, and how do I get it? So today, it's available for existing customers to upgrade. On September 4th, it will be available in retail establishments to buy in a box. Fantastic, Kirk. Thanks for taking the opportunity to speak with us here today at IFA. Congratulations on a successful launch. I hope we get a chance for an update again in the future. Thank you very much. Appreciate talking with you also. I've been speaking with Parallels, Mr. Kirk Schumacher here in IFA in Berlin. I am Tony Sklar with BNET TV.